I give an honor to God who's my everything. Yes. And I'm not one to like testifying because I know it gives honor to God, but the testimonies that he gives me, it makes people feel bad sometimes. And I got my bodyguard over here, so I'm going to testify today. Hallelujah. We're going through a pandemic, yes. But when we love the Lord with all our mind, our heart, and our soul, God got us. He takes care of us. He's created me, Dr. Bell, 51 years old, three children, raised to supervisor status, teenager with her own business teacher. God did all of this. I come to the house of the Lord just to say thank you. To give honor for everything that he's done for me. God is the best husband that I could ever have. I am a single mom. But God is the best husband. Can't nobody cover Dr. Bell like God can. I want to say, and please don't take this the wrong way. I live in a three bedroom, two bath, two car garage home in a beautiful, quiet, gated community. I don't have a job per se, but God makes sure that $1,600 a month is taken care of. I don't want for nothing. My children don't want for nothing. There's food overflow out of my house, so I turn my garage into a food pantry. This is what life looks like when you truly serve God. We got to stop talking about God. We got to stop having God in our mouth all the time. But we got to be about God. Mm -hmm. We got to be this thing. Mm -hmm. We got to stop preaching out of our head and start preaching out of our heart. Our greatest witness, the greatest evangelism that I believe is how we evangelize in our members. How we treat one another. Amen. How we love on one another. The, regardless of the color, shapes, sizes, and color. <laughs> regardless. My disclaimer is that was Rabbi made me do that video. <laughs> but what I'm saying is when you love God for real, when you treat him as God for real, like he's really something, like he's not just a thought in the back of your head, you don't get weary. You get up every morning, and I'm going to say this, and I'm going to sit down. I thank God for creating me to be a, a single mom. My my thoughts and everything go on to him. Now, if I was a wife, my thoughts and everything go on to my husband. I don't need no middleman right now, especially if he ain't following God. I need to be right with God. But in creating me a single mom, I can't roll over and say, you get up and do this. You get up and do that. I got to get up because I'm the only mom, only parent that they have. So it's taught me that when things happen, when in the kingdom of God, when things need to be done, I don't look for the next person to do it. I got to get up and go do it. Amen. So we got to come out of our comfort zone. God is calling us closer to be in him. He said, if you abide in me, I will abide in you. We got to be abiding in him. We got to believe this thing is real. Amen. We got to stop compromising. We got to stop hanging out with people in our ears and our eye gates. Amen. We got to protect our gates. Amen. We got to stop compromising because if he parked the clouds right there and there, you can't say, oh, Lord, I'm sorry. Yeah. 
Let me get it together. It's a done deal. And yes, we've been saying Jesus has been coming back all the 51 years I've been here. But you know what? If you look at the cemetery, you know he's been here. He's been here. He come back every day for somebody. So all I'm asking you to do is turn back to your first love. Amen. Get to know Christ like you did when you first got saved. When you first fell in love with him. Amen. And to stay in worship. Serve him like he's your, your imaginary friend. I talk to him all the time. People, I'm in mental health, so I, I can get covered. You know, people think I'm talking to myself all the time, but I be talking to God. I have to. Amen. I don't come to the house to worship. I stay in worship. Amen. I walk everywhere I walk. I worship. If I'm not talking to somebody, I'm talking to God. That's how you pray without ceasing. It's just conversation with God. Amen. Put God on your heart first. Pray my strength. Amen. 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 Amen.